Hey, what's up guys? DBL here, bringing you something different today. That's right, we're switching gears and bringing you some Mario Kart 8 DLC gameplay on the Wii U. That's right, DLC Pack 1 is out and Mario Kart 8 has been updated to version 3.0. That's right, we're going to be showing you guys some of the new features provided by the system update and we'll be going over all of the new characters, tracks, and vehicles found in DLC Pack 1. But first things first, if you went ahead and updated Mario Kart 8, you'll notice a brand new feature, Amiibo. Mario Kart 8 has been updated to integrate Amiibo support, which means you'll be able to use Nintendo's miniature figurine line to grant your Miis customized suits based off Nintendo's mascots. Amiibos will be going on sale within the next couple of weeks, so hopefully you guys are ready for that. Now let's take a look at the DLC pack that went live today. Now this is just going to be a quick review of the DLC pack since we've gone over it in a previous video. But in this pack, we will be getting three new characters, Link, Tanuki Mario, and Cat Peach, as well as four brand new vehicles, the Blue Falcon from F-Zero, the Tanuki Kart, the B-Dasher from older Mario Kart games, and the Master Cycle. Finally, we are getting eight brand new tracks over two Grand Prix, split between the all-new Egg Cup and the Triforce Cup. Definitely a lot of good stuff in this DLC pack. Next up, let's take a look at the characters and carts themselves. As we head on to the character select screen, you'll notice that you can now select the brand new DLC characters Link from The Legend of Zelda, Cat Peach from Super Mario 3D World, and finally, Tanuki Mario. However, we're going to be sticking with the OG Link. Now we'll take a quick look at the brand new vehicles, the Blue Falcon, the Tanuki Kart, the Bee Dasher, and finally, well, when I can find it, the Master Cycle. Personally, my favorite of these is definitely the Master Cycle and the Blue Falcon. I especially love the detail on the Master Cycle, complete with Helian Shields. This cycle even gets its own specialized wheels and a glider, fully featuring the symbol of the royal family of Hyrule. Alright, next up, let's take a look at these new tracks. In the Egg Cup, we've got the GameCube Classic Yoshi Circuit, the Excite Bike Arena which is brand new and looks really fun, Dragon Driftway, and finally, Mute City from F-Zero. And then in the Triforce Cup, we've got Wario's Gold Mine from Mario Kart Wii, the original Rainbow Road from Super Mario Kart on the Super Nintendo, a brand new track in Ice Ice Outpost, and finally, Hyrule Circuit, which is actually the track that we're going to be displaying in this video right here. But alright, that pretty much covers DLC Pack 1 for Mario Kart 8. From here on out, it's going to be nothing but gameplay. Hopefully you guys enjoy, and as always, I am the Black Link. You guys, stay frosty. Come <laughs> on. 